Okay, so now we're in the north end, still heading to Sokolov's house. Send us food, not bullets. Let's see if we got some. Oh, I got a bone charm and a rune. Sweet. That rune will be handy. I do not want to drink or carry. Must get loot. Stash tip. Higgins, I recently got a tip about a stash hidden at the north end of Caldwell's Bridge. Another crazy bastard keeping all of his shiny stuff in a secret room. I was told you need to turn on the faucet in an old sink three times to open up some kind of secret door. No more information on the value of what's in the room. I only heard about a street speaker hanging over the road just outside the door. Sorry about that, mate. Don't forget my share if you find it. Okay then, well that will certainly help, and let's not fall down there, that would suck. Okay, well I think, okay there was a faucet, there was a faucet. There's also this. Did nothing. Okay. Gonna go in here. And there's a faucet right here. Oh god. You know what? I just don't want to 
to deal with you. So, fuck you. <laughs> Alright. Well, that was fun. But that didn't help me get to the bone charm, so... Anyway... Let's go out here and try some other stuff. Try going up here again. Slash the stuff apart. No. There's a door over there. That's it right there. Alright, cool. I think. Swing really sort of slightly faster. Hmm. That's cool. I have to upgrade my powers to carry more stuff. More, more bone tokens. Yeah, close that toilet. Feeling I have to go in there to get it. Should I go loud or should I just be sneaky? Remain oblivious, young man. Coin. 
coins. I need coins. Down the stairs. You don't see me. You don't see a thing. You're pissing me off, buddy. to my 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 reach To go exploring. If the ship is dead, we'll make it three more. What are you guys? What's that? Oh, that's the gate there. Okay. Uh, 
another safe. I can just open it. Awesome. Yes. Close that thing. Close that toilet. <coughs> Stick it up the joint. Okay. Ah, oh, goddammit. I'm thinking it's time to look at this, make a route, go in this window, okay that's where I was, look up and find out that there's a chain hanging there. How am I going to reach it? That's my only problem. I don't know if I'm going to get that chain. It's too far away. Save. Nope. Totally loading that. Let's try this again. Yes. Huh? Oh, hey, what's up? Someone get over here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. That's perfect. So, um, on the roof. Yay! Yay, alternate pathways. Let's take a look here. It's right in there. Get to this door? Yes. I turn my hopes and energies to Formula 25, which in conjunction with the high heat therapy, which came to me most vividly in a dream last night, has great potential, according to the latest celestial alignment. As for test subject 312, after the king. Rustic sloughing of the skin. She should be dead by mid morning tomorrow. Please, sir. Please let me go. Ah, awake, I see. How are you feeling? Much. Much worse. Do I have the plague? Please, sir. I don't want to die. Hush now. No one's going to die. You are much improved, number 312. The formula I administered to you is working exactly as it should. What is this? What? How did you get past all the guards? Your tattoo is quite unusual. It is reminiscent of markings I've studied on cave walls far from the city. Who sent you? Piero? That jealous fool. There's no need to be his lap hound. You and I can come to an agreement. One that I'm sure will please you more than anything Piero dreamed up. Who are you? What is it you want? Money? Elixir against the plague? I don't know how you got past all the defenses, but I think I can assume if you wanted me dead. Well, we wouldn't be having this conversation. Everything within my power to give you is yours. If you'll just let me go, 
I can see you are an intelligent man, so you understand there will be repercussions if you should harm me. I am the Royal Physician, head of the Academy of Natural Philosophy. Stay back! Have you no heart? Please! Okay. Before you do anything rash, I think we can come to an agreement. It doesn't matter who sent you. Whatever they are paying you, I will double it, triple it. No? You are My pathetic. It's not the only thing I have in abundance. Perhaps there are other rewards you seek. I see you are a determined man. Is there nothing I can offer you? Sir? Who are you? What is... Yeah. <laughs> Stop talking. Thank you, whoever you are. He kept me in a cage, like an animal. Get out of here. horrible right now. So I'll just hide in a corner and leave when I'm feeling better. Sokolov here. Excellent progress today. Test subject 312 is declining rapidly. As mm -hmm. I theorized. Formulas 12 and 17, administered in combination, greatly accelerated the progression of the disease. It placed a respiratory mucosa that erupted and raised pustules, grayish in color, which burst bridging and pain. I now turn my hopes and energies to Formula 25. Which, in conjunction with a high heat there is not a movie with to be Sam Jackson vividly in a dream last night <laughs> has great potential according to the latest celestial alignment as for test of degree 12 after the characteristic swapping of the skin she should be dead by mid morning tomorrow hmm. and uh as requested, this is a sample of the black market elixir we believe is coming from the abandoned distillery. No doubt it's inferior to your formula or even to Pierre's remedy, but people are just desperate. We have not been able to identify the additional ingredients. Perhaps you'll have better luck. One thing of note, some of the men of the watch claim when pressed to have, the pr uh, to have purchased and used this stuff from time to time since it's cheaper than either of the popular brands. None of them report any illness or complications. So while it may not protect from the plague as well, it doesn't seem harmful. Hmm. Alright, so I came in the easy way. Is there any guards around? Of course there are. I'm gonna take everything I can. Bull rat study. <clears throat> the bulk of the rodent is hardly the most interesting detail, though it is the one first remarked upon by visiting colleagues who came to study my prize from Pendicia. Upon further observation, it becomes obvious that the specimen exhibits greater cunning than its, than its cousins native to temperate Gristall. Twice in the night, I have awoken to find it loose in my apartments. So a, cage, a new cage had to be devised, an entertaining diversion, but a waste of my precious time. The dietary tests I have conducted have also provided some surprise. The Pendician bull rat, I can say with confidence, is not finicky eater. Not a finicky eater. With equal gusto, I have seen many, or my little guests dine upon another, uh, upon other smaller rats, living felines, and other corpses corpse flesh of a plague-dead woman found in the Renhaven River. 
for this to do is required. Hmm. Well, that's gross. Alright, so there's gotta be a way out of here. Get coast now. of Hindicea. At the Academy of Natural Philosophy, they speak of Pendicean content, uh, continent as a place of wonder where all of life, excuse me, has entwined and blossomed across ocean, or aeons rather, uh, producing a vibrant ecology unrivaled in the civilized world. The overseers from the Abbey of the Everyman, by contrast, talk of horror and heresies of cults of sub- men engaged in brutal, perverse rituals. A few of, who have traveled to the far continent can, came back to the isles. Those who have actually touched the soil there have returned with notes that describe vast deserts, deep jungles, and outlandish creatures that defy belief. Once in a generation, a great effort is mounted to build a colony there in hopes that this someday growing into a port city to rival Dunwall itself. But to date, these attempts have all ended in madness and failure. Hmm. I think going this way. Like you sneak in and then stealth kill everyone out.
Okay then. Get Mr. Sleepy Time here. He's this way as well. This could get tricky. Right. <coughs> Ricardus claims he memorized the litany on the white cliff in a night. Is it possible? Yes, yes. It's totally possible. to you really badly okay so those machines are horrible they, they you can't use your powers and um, they slow you down and it's like I, I, I looked over I'm like oh my health is going down hmm. Captain Hell Creek when you and your men arrive tomorrow, I'll be working in my greenhouse on the roof. Um, okay. What the hell is that? I want to get you to walk through it. I'll just leave that off. To Yeah, 
Samuel. Down there. Get caught by anything. Wait a second. Okay, there's nothing over there. Okay, so then I can just. Teleporter? There we go. Royal physician himself. You made a neat job of it. Drop him here and we'll be off. All right. And thus ends the mission. I have successfully found and kidnapped that man. I didn't find any of his paintings. I found about half of the gold that's available in the level. And I missed that one room in the safe because I was just too lazy. And where the hell was that bone charm? That uh, must have been the first level, or first area. I killed two civilians, somehow. Uh, raised only one alarm, so that's not bad. High chaos. Yeah. I know. <laughs> cool. I'm pretty happy with that mission. It was actually pretty you set up nice. Myself or so off and you'll pretty, pretty fun. Shackles and everything. It'll be a shock him waking up in the straw and old dog group. From what I hear, he's woken up worse places. Guess we all have it back. Hey. Uh, this game looks so pretty. Yeah, that's right, I said pretty. Well done, Colonel. Well done. I doubt a dozen soldiers could have done it better. Sokolov's knowledge will enable us to strike at the Lord Regent directly, and ultimately help you get your life back. Soon, we won't have to hide in the shadows. The Royal Physician is brilliant, but he was a fool to protect the Lord Regent. Sokolov gave us the elixir, the war machine. He could have made us a great nation. Now he pays the price for siding with a tyrant. You have my thanks, sir. If you wish to get some sleep, now is a good time. Alright, you're welcome. And I probably will. I'm gonna wind down first though. Alright. What's up, Stan? I hope they don't have to hurt him. He's done some good in his time. Made that elixir against the plague he did. Well, fair enough. But he's been doing some really, really shitty stuff. Mm -hmm. Last a while. Experimenting on people, all that nonsense. Mm -hmm. Got a boom charm. Attention, citizens. This evening, the street adjacent to Pendleton Manor will be closed for a private ceremony following the tragic loss of two of our city's best and brightest, the Lord's Custis and Morgan Pendleton. All holdings and parliamentary votes now fall to Lord Trevor Pendleton, who asks for respect during this time of mourning. Hmm. Way up there. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Be aware that looting of evacuated no. areas is a serious offense and will be summarily punished by the officers of the law. Display your pride in Dunwall by respecting the property and rights of others in the area. Alright, let's do some upgrades. Oh, I'm so hungry. Eat everyone's food. Wait a second. 
Stone Portal. Normally, I'm a natural philosopher, but today, mm. consider me a humble craftsman here to serve. All right, so serve me. What's for dinner? Oh, stealth boot. Sweet upgrade. Um, increase the radius. Combat sleep dart. Um, Can't make me any more runes. Can, you, can I purchase them? No, I can't purchase any runes either. Alright, must have been a one time thing. But that's okay. I've got five, nine, I'm, I'm okay for that. That, and I found some more of these. I'll buy a couple. Buy, buy more than a couple. So let's do the stealth boots. Okay, we got another bone charm. Because that seems worth it. Um, okay. Bolt capacity again, maybe? Stealth boots. And I haven't used grenades yet. I should try them sometime. Combat sleep dart. Capacity, so I can carry ten total, or just get stealth boots too. <sighs> so I don't care about this stuff that much. This is a tough decision. Um, I just I want to be really quiet. I'm still gonna kill everything, but I want to be quiet. So maybe I... that's only 300. I got oh, I could do this and optics. Is that so better? Upgrade this. To get, do I care about pistols though? I haven't even used my pistol. This is a tough choice. So I'm just going to go with stealth boots because, yeah, that seems better. I never used my pistol, so what's the point of doing that? And. Ten. I could buy ten more. I could buy an incendiary bolt. One of those would be good. I've got seven of them. I'm done. Okay. Thanks, man. Oh, we got twenty more. All right. Time to go sleep. Stuff around. Guys. Attention, Dunwall citizens. You are required to boil any water from public fountains or the river. Anyone who has consumed untreated water coin. must be reported Every bit to the helps. wash. Or another trap or rewire tool. They're actually important. Alright. I'm an adventurer! Climb to my perch. Yeah, it's nice. Is there any other stuff that I can get? 
Maybe I'll go down here and grab this stuff too. Like, I should grab everything. All the stuff. Give me all the things. He's just throwing the shit out. You're wasteful. Nothing in here. Lady Emily Caldwell was abducted some six months back at the moment of her mother's terrible murder. Anyone with information leading to the location or return of the daughter of our beloved late Empress. Why can't I? It's required to speak to the city watch. Other side. At once. Okay. <laughs> Grab this stuff and that stuff. I've already read this stuff. Hey, what's up? I'm not stealing anything. No. Nope. Let me see here. Stealing everything. What do we got? I am up to two hundred forty one coins. We won't start the interrogation without you. All right. It's good. Where do I find a good meal around here? If you think prison food's bad, you should see what the Abbey serves its captives. Oh, dear. I think the overseers make it themselves. Yeah, well, I'm pretty hungry right now, too, like in reality. All right. Hey, what's going on, man? Put my knife away. Hey. Seems to be everything. And uh, I think that's it for this play. Alright, cool. Time to rest.